I hope this is high enough. Boozer, it's Deacon. Come back. Lost Lake Camp, is anyone there? Deke? Deke, is that you? I can barely hear you. You're, you're cutting out. Where the hell are you? Crater Lake, uh, believe it or not. Hey, uh, I, I... It's good to hear from you again, brother. I thought maybe, uh, thought maybe you were heading back. Uh, no, Boozer, not yet. It's, uh, it, it's complicated. Look, uh, I'm just... I'm just sort of checking in. See how, you know, how everything's going. Good. Good, Deke. Things are going good. You'll never guess who the old man put in charge of security. Wait, you? Yeah, you got it. Guess he figured, you know, with only one arm, I can only cause half as much trouble. Okay. Yeah, like I said, I just, I just wanted to check in. Yeah, it was good to hear from you, brother. <laughs> yeah, you too. Is it? Which way? Gotcha. I gotta find a way inside. Gotcha. I see you running around.
Taylor. Huh. Dickens, St. John. How are we doing, Taylor? That fucked up, man. They didn't mean to kill him, man. He wasn't supposed to be there. I... Doc was a good guy, man. He fucking, he fucking helped me. He helped me. Come on, get up. No. I don't want to hang, man. You kick and you kick Wait. and you shit yourself, all those fucks standing at attention, and they're laughing at you. They're laughing at you. I don't want to. I don't want to. Please, don't let them hang me. St. John. In here. Overdose. God damn it. Bring the body outside. I don't care what a man's done. We never. Leave him for the freaks. I can tell you right now, the Colonel's not gonna be happy about this. Well, when we found him, he was already dead. Overdose. We recovered most of the drugs, not all. As if the world hasn't seen enough corruption and decay. As if the world isn't already filled to overflowing with mindless, soulless creatures. Take these to the infirmary. And this time... Assign someone who isn't a goddamn junkie. Yes, sir. Wait, hold up. You want one alive? Oh, kind of hard to run tests on something dead. Here. What, what, what is that? It's a special tranquilizer. It'll help you knock it out long enough so you can bring it back here. I am so close, Deacon. This could be it. Yes, ma'am. Deacon, come in. Hey, I was just...
got to you, little shit. Another micro recorder. Yeah. Yes. Neuro injector. Ah. Well, was feeling a little under the weather. You wanted a live one? You get a live one. Oh, fucking Jesus Christ. Uh, hey, Captain, uh, pistol over my bike. Uh, yeah, the colonel doesn't allow for pets on the island, I'm afraid. <laughs> uh, lieutenant needed a live test subject. Uh, you two seem to be getting along well. You and Lieutenant Whitaker? Just doing my job, sir. Yeah, we'll keep it professional, Corporal. The colonel doesn't allow for fraternization between enlisted men and officers. Oh, no, no. It can't have any of that, sir. Right. Carry on. Yes, sir. Okay. Come on, help me! Come on! Come on. So much for the tranquilizer. Yeah, well, the biologist is kind of fucked right now. What do you want me to do? I can't get the right dosage. Here, hold on, hold on. This is what I've been working on. How long? Oh, hold on, just a few seconds. Oh, shit. Holy shit. God damn. <laughs> well, whew. I don't know what you put in that. That shit went down fast. Damn it! <laughs> but you're, you're... You're not making a bioweapon, you're... Oh my god, are you, are you... Are you trying to cure it? I thought... That once I got the original cell line from Cloverdale that I could create antibodies for the virus, and I could reverse engineer it. Jesus. And now all of that work, everything that I have worked on is for nothing. I can't save them. Nothing's gonna be able to change them back. So get up, dust yourself off. Try again. 
Were you not seeing what just happened? Every cell in that kid's body just exploded. That's exactly why you can't quit. What? Because you called it a kid. Do you have any idea how many of these things that I've killed? And it never once occurred to me, you know what, that used to be someone's kid. You know, I met this girl once, and she used to talk about the freakers the same way you do. She used to call them sick people. I thought that was crazy, but she looks at them the same way that you do. So you think I'm crazy? No, no. I think you're the first sane person I've seen in two years. You know, I still remember the night that I lost you, but I'm starting to realize it wasn't the night that I had left you on that chopper. It was the next night. Me and Boozer, we rode into that refugee camp that you were supposed to be waiting at, right? Except there's freakers everywhere. The choppers are on fire. There's people screaming, so many people. And so we fought, and we won, and what did we get? Bodies. Bodies everywhere. And I checked every corpse, every face. There must have been a thousand of them, maybe more. I checked every single one. That was the night that I lost you. And Boozer. Boozer, you know, he's, <laughs> he's just, he was just trying to keep me together for the next two years. But I didn't give a shit about any of it. And then I see this Nero chopper flying around in the sky and I start to feel something. I'm thinking, you know what? Fuck you. Fuck you. Because even if she is alive, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to find her. We're going to ride away. We're never going to look back. Because I don't want to be part of some militia. I don't want to fight in a war and I don't want to live in some camp. So why are you still here? Because of you. All of this, seeing how hard you work, seeing how dedicated you are. Most people out there are just trying to survive, and here you are. Trying to save the goddamn world. Yeah, well, I'm not doing a very good job. So you get up, you dust yourself off, and you try again. We're going back to Cloverdale. They got better equipment. We're going to dig into their research deeper. do that you would help me yeah I would I would because you believe in this don't give up we'll ride north yeah, we'll ride north. We'll, we'll tell them that we're going on a supply run. Yeah, but we're not coming back. No, we're gonna go AWOL. You know if they catch us, they will hang us. Then we hang together. Ma'am? <clears throat> yeah? Deke, Colonel wants to see you. Be right there. Pack up what you need, I'll be back. Thank you. Yes, ma'am. Corporal St. John. Colonel, sir. Come with me, please. Are we ready? Colonel, sir. Yes, sir. That shit is locked and loaded. Uh, bike's already loaded, sir. I'm not sure if I understand. Lieutenant Weaver's weapon is finished. We're ready to test it. Hell yeah. Are you ready to burn down a horde? Oh. Something wrong, Corporal? No, sir. No, no, no. Um, hell yeah. Let's get this done. All right. Now you're talking, man. Gentlemen, this is the start of a new era. Carry on. Lieutenant Weaver, with me. Yes, sir. I, figured that I think we should... you should stay up here and let me do this alone. What the fuck? You got a death wish? No. That's why I think I should go in alone. Look, even with Weaver's jacked up Molotovs, we can't take an entire horde all at once. No. So, uh... I figure I go down there. I get their attention. I pull off a few at a time and then I run like hell. And I gotta find some way to 
Slow him down, maybe set a few traps. And then I blow him to hell. Look, two of us running around down there. It's gonna be chaos. We'll just pull the horde down on each other. No, you stay up here. You keep an eye on me. If shit goes south, you ride in there, you get me the hell out. Hmm? Unless you got a better plan. I got nothing. <laughs> I've got more Molotovs, ammo, in my saddlebags. Good, good. Uh, shit's gonna come in handy. Let's see. Tell me your plan again. Like I said, find a way to slow them down. The sons of bitches like to clump up, climb all over each other. If I can find a narrow space between trucks, buildings, whatever, it'll take them a while to get through. And once I get some space between me and them, you'll blow them the hell up. You got it. Rinse, repeat, a few times. No more horde. That's your plan. Oh, that's my plan. Good luck, St. John. Hawk's got nothing to do with it. All right, I'm heading in. I see you. Let me know if you need my help. <laughs> Copy that.
Yeah, no problem. No problem. More bound. Sarah, are you there? Uh, Lieutenant Whitaker, this is Corporal St. John reporting in. Come back. Oh, where the hell are you? Captain, uh, I just tried to check in with Lieutenant Whitaker and she's not answering. Couldn't wait to tell her the good news? Yeah, she'll be thrilled. I bet. You'll see her soon enough. Don't radio Lieutenant Weaver. I want to tell him the news in person. Okay, you earned that. Copy that. St. John out. I got a better plan. We did it. You did it. Uh, Weaver did it. Oh. I've never seen anything like this. I mean, the way you were one step ahead of him. Ever had a horde breathing down your neck? It really keeps the adrenaline flowing. Maybe the colonel's right. Maybe we can win this war. Hey, how'd it go? Oh, I'm sorry, Lieutenant. Oh, shit. It didn't work? Sorry, Lieutenant, but you're out of a job. Hell yeah, it worked. Oh, yeah! <laughs> you should have been there, man. We really lit him up. Oh, man! We're going to celebrate tonight. The officer's mess. <laughs> All right. Looks like somebody's getting a promotion. Hey, man, you coming? Uh, you know what? Let me, I'm going to catch up with you. I got I to gotta take care of something first. All right, you handle that. That's the last of it. Be careful not to break anything. Some of these things are... Irreplaceable. What's going on? Uh, where is the lieutenant? Corporal St. John. I'm sorry, sir. It's all right, son. All essential personnel doing R&D have been moved. Moved? Where? Uh, because I need to deliver these supplies that she asked for. I understand. There's... been a... Walk with me, son. Please. Ma'am, Colonel's orders. Matt, you can't do this. You can't keep me locked in here. Eddie's cup. And then the Lord said to Noah, Enter the ark, you and all your household. For you alone I have seen to be righteous before what? me in this time. What are you talking about? I'm sorry, you, Lieutenant. You can't! Colonel, wait! Hey! It's fine. It's fine. Ma'am, I got the, uh, supplies that you asked for. Come on in. Follow me. I've been working on a new assignment. Poison this time. Listen. 
When you pick this, you have to do it carefully. If you don't, it could kill you. Understood. I'm gonna get you out of here. Thank you. Yes, ma'am. St. John. Sir, I was... You know when I was young? We used to explore caves like these. Looking for petroglyphs, carvings by the Modoc, other tribes. Thousands of years old. You know, they never lived in these caves, the heathens. In the cold and the dark. But look at us. Look how far we have fallen. Colonel, Colonel, I, I was... The soldier who used to be assigned to Lieutenants Whitaker and Weaver, the soldier you replaced, has gone AWOL. He broke into my private chambers and took my personal copy of the Holy Bible. I want it returned. Yes, sir. I've marked his last known location on your map. Dismissed, Corporal. <laughs> 